take a look at this. A big temperature swing is going to be heading our way. Again, we're forecasting today's high temperature right around 73. But as we head into Sunday, high temps only in the 50s. So Sunday is definitely going to feature very different weather from what we will deal with throughout the day today. And that's all thanks to a cold front that will be passing through this evening. It's 48 degrees right now at Philadelphia International 47 in Wilmington, 47 in Millville. Down the shore, we're in the lower 50s. It's 51 in Atlantic City, 50 in Wildwood. We are checking in in the mid 40s up there in the Poconos. And locally, it's 45 in Pottstown, 48 in Media, Molica Hill at 48. We have 51 in Palmyra. It's 47 up into Doylestown and Mount Holly. You guys are checking in around 45 degrees. Now, showed you those foggy conditions, those pictures from our weather watchers. Well, the calm winds are not helping with that situation. In fact, they are contributing to the fogginess across the region and reduced visibilities. In fact, some locations were dealing with visibilities less than a mile, like Allentown, Reading, Lancaster, Wilmington, Millville, all the way to Atlantic City, even Trenton tapping into visibilities less than a mile. So if you do have to hit the roads early this morning, just be mindful of that. Give yourself a little extra time, but overall we should see that fog dissipate fairly quickly. 56 degrees by 9 o'clock, 65 as we head into the noon hour. We'll see a good amount of full sunshine, but then I think later on this afternoon we will tap into some increasing clouds once again, but at least high temperatures make it into the 70s, right? Overall quiet on storm scan 3 right now, but as I zoom out, a system located up to our north and west and a cold front associated with that is what's going to be swinging on through as we head into this evening. So tracking that for you here on future weather again, we'll see the fog kind of dissipating and breaking up some sunshine as we head into the afternoon. Those clouds begin to increase from the west and then I think between about 6 and 10 o'clock we'll see some showers, maybe even a thunder shower passing through the I-95 corridor. So if you are heading out to uh, the Phillies game, probably the first couple of innings will be just fine, but later on in the game we could deal with a little bit of a rain delay and also pen relay should go on just fine today because I think uh, the rain holds off until after those are done. Here we are at 11 o'clock, a stray shower kind of lingering around. Then we dry out overnight. We should see more clouds around across the region as we head into Sunday. Highs today, though, a little bit cooler down the shore. Also up in the Poconos will tap into high temps in the 60s. But as that wind uh, blows off the water from the south and then southwest today, ocean temperature in the lower 50s. That's why those locations along the coast will be a little bit cooler, but further inland we're talking about those high temps right in the 70s. Now beyond this weekend that jet stream lifts way up to the north, especially as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday. So what does that mean for us? Well, here is a look. We're looking at 78 degrees as we head into Tuesday, Jan 84 on Wednesday and then 86 on Thursday. I mean, feeling like summer in Philly. Look at that stretch. Loving I love it. it, Chelsea. Thank you.